Hello, P2 members and P1. I remember, I normally say, even P1s are welcome. I hope you are fine. Okay? Yes. We, uh, we finished now tense last time, and now we are going to another thing. My name is Tumine Joy, as usual, teaching P2 English. Okay? Now, today we are going to look at another interesting and very good and very easy topic. That is vocabulary. Today we are going to learn about words. We are going to look at words and we are going to see what we do with those words. Okay? Okay. Now, by the end of this lesson, I expect you to read the learnt words, the words that I have taught you. Make sure you know how to read them because we are going to read them together. Okay? Then I expect you to use the words in sentences. They at home, make sure you use these words we are going to learn in sentences and make correct sentences, right? Then you have to use the structures correctly. We are going to look at the structures, how we ask the question, and then we answer using those words that we are going to look at, okay? Are you ready? All right, good children. Now, <clears throat> today we are going to look at the words. Have you ever seen these words? And new words are called vocabulary. Can you say vocabulary? All right. The first one is fisherman. Can we read together? Fisherman. Have you ever seen a fisherman? I went to the lake last weekend and I found a fisherman and he sold fish to me. It was very big fish. Very nice. I enjoyed the fish. The fisherman caught fish from the lake. Very, very big fish. And I bought it. I went home and enjoyed. So the fisherman uh, gave me the fish and I went. He caught the fish from the lake. Okay? Everybody say fisherman. Fisherman. Carpenter. Carpenter. Can we read? Carpenter. Yes. We have, I have nice, I have a nice cupboard at home. I got it from a workshop. Do you know whom I, whom I found in the workshop? It was a carpenter was making very good furniture and I bought a cupboard. The carpenter sold the cupboard to me. That carpenter makes good things. A carpenter makes things from wood, like our desks in class. Okay, mechanic, mechanic, mechanic. The mechanic, my, 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 my vehicle, Do you, you know I have a vehicle. So one time it got a problem. I said, now what can I do? How do I, how do I, do, what do I do on this? I just said, oh, there is someone who can repair it. I went to a place, that place was a garage. I found the mechanic, a mechanic fixed my vehicle and I was very happy. Oh, the mechanic, everybody said mechanic, mechanic. Yeah, the mechanic repairs things, repairs machines, repairs vehicles, repairs anything that can be, that has got spoiled. Okay. Policeman. Policeman. I know you know policemen. A policeman normally has a uniform, smartly dressed. You can find him at the police station. Sometimes a policeman is a traffic policeman. You find him on the road stopping the cars. Yes, a policeman. Everybody say policeman. Uh-huh. Then police woman. Yes, there are even ladies who are police women. You find them very well dressed in their uniform. Police women, they also do, do the work the policemen do. Okay? They keep law and order and we find them at the police station. How many of you have ever gone to the police station to do what? Are you a wrongdoer? No, don't be a wrongdoer. Okay. Teacher. Ever say teacher? Teacher. Yes, I'm a teacher. I'm teaching. A teacher teaches. And we find a teacher at school. Like now, I'm teaching. I'm a teacher. Yes? I love my teachers who taught me in primary. Ha, they were good. Uh-huh. Soldier. Soldier. Everyone says soldier. Make sure you learn these spellings. Soldier. Yes, a soldier is the, a, a policeman can also be a soldier. Uh, an army man can also be a soldier, and even an LDU man. Do you know LDUs? Yes, those are all soldiers. Mm -hmm. Another one, doctor. Everybody said doctor. 
doctor. Yes, when you are sick, don't you go to the hospital, to the clinic, that clinic near your home. There is a doctor. A doctor treats sick people. Yes. Uh-huh. Hunter. Everyone say hunter. How many of you have ever seen a hunter? Do you know a hunter? I guess you don't know because you don't, the hunters don't, don't do their work in the town. They do it in the villages, in the bush. They go to the bush, to the forest, and they kill animals and bring meat home. They get meat, okay? Yes, that meat from wild animals, okay? So a hunter uses a spear. He goes with a spear and the dog, those, those dogs at your home, you think they are just for guarding your home. They are also used for hunting. Hunters use dogs and spears. They go to the bush and they kill animals for meat. Okay, hunter. Then there's lawyer. Lawyer. Have you ever seen a lawyer? What do, where can we find a lawyer? In court. A lawyer, a lawyer pleads for people in court. He goes there and pleads for you. If you have done something wrong, you can imagine those lawyers. <laughs> they even plead for you if you have done something wrong. They plead for you in court. You can win the case. But lawyer, everybody say lawyer. So look at that spelling, lawyer. A lawyer pleads for people in court. Yes, they are normally dressed smartly in courts. Ah, very smart in suits. Uh-huh. Plumber. Everybody say plumber. Plumber. Yes. A plumber. I one time my my bathroom had a pipe which was broken. I called a plumber. Said, please come. My, my, my pipe, my bathroom is spoiled. The water cannot go. I don't know what is happening. The plumber came and checked the, the pipes, repaired them, and my bathroom is fine now. So that one is a plumber. He repairs, he repairs pipes, okay? Water pipes. Plumber. Everybody say plumber. Plumber. Uh-huh. Shopkeeper. Shopkeeper. Where do you find a shopkeeper? Do you know a shopkeeper? Are you one of them? Is your parents? Is your parent one of them? Oh, where do we find a shopkeeper? In a shop, yes, that one I said in a shop. A shopkeeper sells things in a shop. That person you find there and you say, please, may I have a sweet? And he gives you. That one is a shopkeeper. Okay? Okay. Driver. Everybody say driver. Driver. Even at school we have drivers. At your home you have drivers. Even your parents are drivers. They drive cars. Yes. I love, I love the drivers. Even me, myself, I'm a driver. I know how to drive, okay? I drive a car. Huh? What about you? Uh, you are still young. Don't go to drive daddy's car. You are not a driver. You must have a driving permit, okay? Driver. Everybody say driver. Uh -huh. Farmer. Farmer. Can you say farmer? Yes. Good children. Farmer. Do you know a farmer? A farmer. That person. Who goes to the who has a farm and he works on a farm and he grows crops, he rears animals or he keeps animals. A farmer, that is a farmer. Yes, farmers are very nice people, like in this corona for them, they were lucky. They continued working on their farms. They are, I, I think one of you would be a farmer. Would you like to be a farmer? Yes, no, it is good, it is a good job. Okay, pilot, pilot. Do you know a pilot? Yes. I can see, uh, and today when I was teaching, when I started teaching, I saw an aeroplane. Who was there? A pilot. It was a pilot flying it. Ooh, ah, I think I wanted to become a pilot, but I don't know what happened. I know many of you are going to become pilots. Yes, make sure you study very hard. Pay attention in the class, and you'll be a good pilot. Make sure you are attentive. Okay, builder. Builder. What do you think a builder does? Who is a builder? Have you ever seen one? Do you have any building, any new building at home that they are constructing? Those people who are, are, are constructing it are called builders. When he's one, he's a builder. When there are many builders, we just add S to this word and it becomes builders. Okay? All right. Oh, there are so many. All these are uh, uh, 
words of people, name uh, titles of people who do different work in our community. Can we read them very fast? Fisherman, carpenter, mechanic, policeman, policewoman, teacher, soldier, doctor, hunter, lawyer, plumber, shopkeeper, driver, farmer, pilot, builder. Yes? Have we read together? Have you learned the spellings? Learn those spellings. You have to learn them. Okay. Now, let's look at some of them. Look at this. Who is this? A fisherman. Oh, look at that fish. He has caught fish from the lake. This is the lake. He was in this boat, maybe. And he caught a lot of fish. Oh, look at it. Do you like fish? Yeah. When you go to the lake, the fisherman will sell the fish and to you and you go and cook. Yes, like how I told you that I went to the lake and bought a big fish. This fisherman is the one I think. Mm, I can recognize the one. So this is a fisherman. Then that one, a lawyer. See how smart she is. Smartly dressed. Wow, this one is a lawyer. Okay? All right. Let's look at another one. Oh, policewoman. I told you that when she's a woman, she's a policewoman. Look at her. Very well dressed. You see? Okay. Then, policeman. Do you know this policeman? Don't you normally see him on TV? He normally talks on TV. This man is a policeman. See how they are very smart in their uniform. Okay? So when he's a man, he's a policeman. When he's a, she's a woman, she is a police woman. Okay? All right. Ah, what about this one? This one is a plumber. See how he's fixing the pipe, the pipe of this sink. It was spoiled and he's fixing it. Okay? So the, this is a plumber. You can see how serious he is. He's, he likes his job. Good. Okay. Now, after doing all that, I have the structures here, or the sentences, the questions and the answers, okay? We are using the other words we learned. Look at them. Number one, who treats patients? Who treats patients? You don't just say a doctor. That is not English. We have to answer a doctor treats patients, okay? Let's go to number two. Who catches fish from the lake? Who catches fish from the lake? A fisherman catches fish from the lake. Who? You have to put there that person catches fish from the lake. Who makes furniture? A carpenter makes furniture. Remember, we answer in full sentences and we put a full stop at the end. If you don't put a full stop, that sentence is wrong. If you don't answer in full, it is wrong. In English, we answer in full sentences. Another sentence. Who repairs machines and vehicles? Do you remember that one? A mechanic repairs machines and vehicles. Who teaches pupils? That one you know. But I know, I know someone has said, a teacher. Uh -huh. That is not correct. You have to say, a teacher teaches pupils. A full sentence with a full stop and beginning with a capital letter. Very good children. Now, I want, you to, I want to give you one exercise. Very simple. Like this, answering questions. Remember to answer in full sentences. Okay? Yes, that is the activity. You have to answer the questions correctly like how we have been answering them here, okay? Number one, who keeps law and order? Do you remember that one? Yes, but answer in full. Who sells things in a shop? Answer in full. Who pleads for people in a court? Do you remember that one who was dressed smartly and in full sentence? Who drives vehicles? Who treats patients? Who repairs water pipes? I would like to see that exercise. You will send it to me, okay? But make sure you do it. Good children, we meet next time. Thank you for listening.